You know, anybody who goes to Hollywood, I don't know what happens, they become brainwashed. First you get the cashies, then you get the gaysies. Just be careful you don't get a racies. I contend with this on a daily basis on Twitter. Oh, John went Hollywood. <laughs> And I'm so sick and tired of people complaining about those in Hollywood, the Hollywood elite, and he's the gash man, he's the king of, he's the viceroy of vagina, if you will, because they are a lover of the arts. And the arts are about expression. And that is why, and the arts are about not only creativity, but it's about empathy and compassion. <laughs> they are fond of people that express uh, the, the uh, criminalities that go on in society. And under the against factory, something against factory, so what's that the best blowjob with factory? I would think she was hungry or something, but I'll take it. True story, her name was Missy. I brought her home, she... That's why you have movies like Schindler's List that shows you what happened during the Holocaust. Do you have a fart in the bathtub? Like Platoon that show you what happened in Vietnam. <laughs> it's because that's who, that's who we are. Does uh, Sinead O'Connor give you a boner? Hollywood doesn't create or make us. It just happens to be gish man because we are a fond lover of the arts. I didn't know anything else I could be other than an entertainer. Are these sweat stains? Yes, they are. I am sick of people saying that Oh, he went Hollywood. Put it this way, J-Lo is supposed to have one of the most beautiful uh, vaginas in the world. That's what I hear. And I hear it from a good source, so I'll stand by it. Probably loves a lot of the movies that us liberals put out. Hello? Excuse me. I would say... Yeah, definitely. Okay, yeah. Please, people, subscribe to my buddy. But it, it's it's funny how you know you pay it forward, and suddenly you know that you know that payment comes back to you know you know will give you a uh, a wonderful payback. Today, I'm going to talk about, well, first, let me plug, I'm going to be at the Ontario Improv tomorrow night. Please come down. And also, I'll just say, Joe Rogan, you're a freaking moron.